Uh, greetings. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is YouTube's Pastor Dow. Um, you know, I think I'm going to echo on the heels of Jason F. Uh He's absolutely right. Uh, you know, when silver was down, uh, and this is my comments right here, when silver was down, I was making a lot of silver videos. And, and of course, in between the time, because this is a real busy part of the year for us, because we're just like the end. We're considered the end. Um, and, and, and I tell you, it, it's totally amazing because... Uh, the other day, he gave a report on his video about how that, you know, for every one person that comes in and sells silver, he has another 30 people lined up, this shop does, to buy it. And there's something about the, the people who understand what just weights and balances are, what, what real true just weights and balances are. I'm sorry, but yes, we do get to spend Federal Reserve notes, just like uh, a long time ago, people used to spend sticks. Um, but it doesn't make uh, Federal Reserve notes or sticks just weights and balances. It's amazing how that the Bible continues to be right over and over and over again. Cassette, silver, just weights and balances. And actually, you know, our, our government and, and all the institutions that they have set up to regulate what they call employment and stuff, they're actually robbing us of wealth. But, you know, it it's a buying opportunity of a lifetime when I've seen it go down to 80, $18. You know, it was down to 18 something dollars. Like, wow. Man, I need to try to get my focus back in again and continue to buy more because, uh, make no mistake about it, Pastor Dowell is still uh, buying silver. And just because I'm not talking about it don't mean that I've stopped. Um, and I think that it would be in your best interest to do the same. All you have to remember is the fundamentals have not changed. Everything is still remains the same. <clears throat> we have no solutions for the debt problem, the extraordinary debt problem. So therefore, you're going to have to do like other governments in, in, in other parts of the world are instructing their people to do, which is to um, store wealth, gold and silver. Um, if you notice, more countries are starting to call back their gold. Uh, they want their gold. They want their gold. They want all the tangible assets because this fiat currency junk is just ain't working no more. Patience is a virtue. Patience is virtue. Just remain patient. Um, remember, this is long-term, long-term investment right here. You can't go wrong. Uh, with it. Um, but I tell you what, for those of us who have exercised this patience and stuff and still understand what's going on, we're going to continue to keep um, going. Oh, by the way, by the way, hey, the other day, you know, very rarely, if any, you know, I, if I buy what you call Klondike bars, and you know, every once in a while I make uh, videos on, on how purchasing power has been eroded from us and, and how that they are cheating us. Uh, they're, they're keeping the price the same, but they're not giving us the same quantity um, of material or, or goods or services. And I bought, I think, you know, I bought some Klondike bars the other day. And I was like, what in the world? I opened up one of them things, and that thing was just about paper thin. Do y'all remember how, how um, thick Klondike bars used to be? You're talking about peed off, man. You know I mean? I, oh, mercy. But the price is still the same. You're just getting less of the product. I don't know what they've done. They must have reset the dyes or whatever they did. But, they man, they cut that bar in half. And Pastor Dollar is upset. And Klondike bars are good, too. At least they taste good. It may not be good for you, but they taste good. Every once in a while, we do eat some bad stuff. But we also purge our system. But I, was, I just thought I had that in there. Um, I think that we ought to get together and, and get some protest signs and go pick it. Klondike factory. What say of you? 